To make Japan's food culture and marine resources sustainable, co-creation between people and technology is underway on the front lines of Japan's fisheries. Mekiki skills for tuna assess quality by looking at a tail cross-section. Consumers expect the highly assessed tuna to be high quality and delicious, and so pay a fair amount for it. Originally, Mekiki was passed down from father to son, but these days, there seem to be fewer opportunities for working in fisheries, and the number of Mekiki experts is declining. We made an app to obtain data of tail cross-sections, and AI uses the deep learning of many expert appraisals. By passing on the Mekiki skill to AI, even without Mekiki experts, I believe we'll still live in a world where we can all enjoy delicious tuna long into the future. AI is also used to analyze operational and oceanographic data from satellites to move away from the fishing industry's traditional reliance on intuition and experience. The rural fishermen all go by intuition. That makes it hard for us to pass on to the next generation. We started by digitizing the fishing logs handwritten by seasoned fishermen and then worked on somehow automating the process. Based on the ship's wake, we can see whether fishermen are resting or have started or finished fishing. AI can now automatically obtain such data. Data is automatically input, and the logbook is created by just letting the ship set sail. I'm very grateful. I think it would be beneficial to keep and later use the data. In addition, traditional fishing methods sometimes fail so to make up for losses, overfishing occurs, leading to resource depletion. Using satellite data to understand what's going on in the straits lets us make predictions while considering fuel costs. By adding AI, I think we won't have to come back empty-handed anymore. We want to use AI to provide services that will enable us to pass on the culture of the fishing industry and marine resources to the next generation. Over the years, we want AI to become able to predict the movement of schools of fish. This system contains all my experience and will help when I pass it on to my son. I think this will have value for future generations. Through co-creation between people and technology, we continue pursuing a sustainable fishing industry.